Libra, welcome back or welcome to my channel if you are visiting for the first time. Thank you guys for being here. This is Sacred Libra where I have a channel that is basically geared to all things Libra, okay? So if you like that, if you're interested in that, then go ahead and click that subscribe button okay for you guys libra i had a message that i really wanted to deliver to you guys yesterday i just got so busy so i decided to jot some things down that i did have and i had a message um while i was meditating the message that i did have is that you're gonna have to walk away from some something that you built libra now let's talk about this because i'm gonna be rapping about this for a while okay some of you guys have put your blood, sweat, and tears into something. And you're going to have to leave that thing where it's at. Be it a relationship. You might have put all your time, all your energy into a person. And you may have to leave that where it's at. Maybe a project. You may have put in all your time, all of your energy, all of your blood, sweat, and tears into something. Okay, it may be something that you're paying for that you've been paying and paying and paying and paying for and you got to walk away. You have to some of some of us are going to have to leave things we've built. It's still in the making. Okay, not saying that it's built and it's finished. And it's like, okay, you know, I built I built this thing. I am done with it. No, I can see some of us putting the blocks down in the building process. Okay. In the building process, and let me tell you what that looked like. That looked like you working, walking away from something that you worked your ass off for. Okay, number one. Number two, that looks like walking away from something that you gave a lot of your energy to. Okay, number three, that also means walking away from something because when we build something, we grow like a love, like a nurturing love to it. So you're going to have to walk away from those things. Trust me when I say this, Libra, that once you let this thing go, like fully, like I feel like for some of you guys, this thing has been has been coming up in different areas in your life and i don't know why it's just on my heart to talk about love like libra when it comes to love i feel like you put yourself out there time and time and time and time again and you worked and you have compromised and you have been a team player and you have gotten people who haven't been so much of team players and you have to sit back yet again and walk away from something it's like yet again like if i felt like you thought that something was going to be over that something was going to be finished that you were going to be done with a certain type of behavior but yet again here you are you you could have sworn that you crossed your t's and dotted all your eyes to make sure that you wasn't going to do the same thing again but guess what libra the same thing happened again the same lesson happened again and like i said yesterday in my message if you guys haven't read that make sure you check that out but I said yesterday that in May, everything will come full circle. From here on to May, I know my May, I would say nearly all of my Libras are going to get it. But from here until May, I just heard on the 11th day. So I'm not sure if this has anything to do with April or May, but on the 11th day. But here until May, you're going to get it. You're going to understand why, okay? I got a feeling that Libra... One of these days, you're going to be thanking your downfalls. You're going to be thanking your enemies. You're going to be thanking all the people who left you high and dry. You're going to be thanking all the people that you put your energy into. Because you know what? It's going to bring you to something that is beyond out of this world. Some type of abundance that you can't even, you can't even envision what is in store for you right now. That's how big and that's how beautiful it is. Okay? We're coming into a season... Well, you're going to start thanking your enemies. You're going to say, you're going to thank God for your trials. You're going to thank God. Thank God I went through that relationship. Thank God for that five-year situationship. Thank God for that 10-year relationship that was stagnant. Thank God for those frenemies. Thank God for the people that I trusted. Because you know what? 
It's going to bring you to a place. It's going to bring you to an amount of abundance that you can't even fathom right now. Like you can't even begin to think of just an ounce of what is coming, what is coming towards you. But in order for you to get that thing, you got to cut ties. Okay. I'm sick of these. Hey, I'm sick of these. Have some help. Hey, get rid of these. You got to cut ties with these people. Okay, you have to cut ties with people or with mindset. If it's not a person, it's a mindset. For some of you guys, it's a business. It's something that's been draining you. It's something that you can build again. It's something that you can build again with more knowledge. It's something that you've been working on. It's putting down the blocks halfway. It's not seeing what you've built. It's not getting to an end. For some of you, I'm speaking the word. For some of you, y'all are in. You got your you got your damn cargo boots on, you know. Uh, cargo boots or cargo pants. You got your cargo pants on with your Timberland boots, got your hat on, and you at work. You working. You working on this thing. And while you working on this thing, it's draining you. While you working on this thing, it's infecting your energy. Okay? While you working on this thing, it's putting so much negativity in you, and you know you better than this thing. You know that you should walk away from this thing that you're working on. But you know what keeps us stagnant? We look at all, we look at all the years that we worked on something, and we like... Dang, but I put five years into it. Dang, but I put 10 years into it. Dang, but we've been doing this thing for three years. I think that this is really going to, you know, I think this really going to, you know, kick off. Dang, but I told this person everything. That's what some people is. Some people have told somebody everything. I put so much trust in this person. But guess what? You got to walk away. And Libra. You have to stop falling in love with potential. You have to stop falling in love with facts. When I tell you, when the next love that's going to come to you, you ain't going to have to question yourself. You ain't going to have to look back and see, oh, what did I build? Or how long have I been here? Should it, you know, determine how long should I stay here? You're going to know clear as day that something is for you. Because you know what? When you put that thing on, that thing going to fit like butter, okay? That thing going to be smooth like butter. It ain't going to be no type of friction no nothing you're not going to have to question anything you're going to know and you're going to sit back and you're going to say i'm thankful for the times when i didn't know when i had to learn these lessons because i didn't know because now what i know what i know now is this is undeniable the uh, the abundance is un undeniable I don't have to question myself. I don't have to question my thoughts. I don't have to question my worth. I don't have to question. I don't have no question marks. That question mark is going to be turned into an explanation mark. Okay. Okay. I'm talking about some type. Cut ties. I'm sick of these. You know what? You sick of these. Uh, that's what I'm hearing. You sick of these people. And it's time for you to cut ties. For a lot of you, it's people. Leave them in the dust. Leave them in the dust. It's people that you probably had probably reached out to, probably thought you can rekindle. rekindle. Some of y'all had some friendships that's just stuck in a little stagnation, not moving forward, not moving back, but just still there. And you put some time into it. This may be friends from 10, 12 years. Take your lessons and take your bags and go, okay? All right, what are we doing? Like, for real, what's going on? Libra, when I say you have some connections, you have some type of abundance coming that's going to have you rejoicing and praising all of your shortcomings that you went through in the past. You want to get this praise can't be messed with, okay? This praise that's coming can't be messed with. Can't nobody mess with this praise that's about to come, that you're about to put over your life. Like, you've been through so much, and you've been working so hard, and you are the person. You are a person of integrity. You are a person who's loyal. You are a person who cares. You are a person who try to make sure everybody is okay and everybody is treated fairly. And what you need to do is take all of you, all of your goodness, and do this. And you gone, okay? You out. It's time to go, okay? The flight, the flight is, you know... The flight is ready. It's time for you to get flewed out, okay? Out of this.
All right. So that's the message that I had on my heart that some of our, some of us are going to be leaving. We're going to be moving away from things that we built. And my heart goes out to you, Libra, because that's a hard thing. You put your blood, sweat, tears, your heart, your love, your joy in it, and to just leave something with with, with blind with blind faith. We we ain't talking about knowing where you're going, okay? We're not talking about having a map and having and having destinations planned out. We're not talking about that. We talk about moving with blind faith. We talk about moving with strict, with, with, with pure hope. We'll hope that you're going into something better. We'll hope that you're going to go into something that equals you. We'll hope that you go into like-minded situations. We'll hope that you go into expansion. Hello? Okay? We talk about blind faith. We're not talking about knowing. No, we're not talking about knowing. We're talking about trusting. And when you get into trusting, you tap into a whole different level on some whole different stuff, okay? I'm telling y'all, when I say from now until May, from to get ready, get them shoes ready, okay? Because that praise, ain't nobody going to be able to mess with that praise, I'm telling you. Ain't nobody going to be able to mess with that praise, all right? Thank y'all for being here. I love you, Libra. Make sure you click like, share, and subscribe. I love y'all. Have a beautiful day. I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.